Hello and welcome to the Price Academy Bite Size History Videos. This video is introducing Spartacus the Revolting Gladiator. Spartacus was a Roman slave and gladiator who led a revolt against Rome which turned into the Third Civil War between 73 BC and 71 BC. Spartacus was born in Thrace, an area where the modern day Balkan states including Turkey, Bulgaria and Greece are located. Spartacus could have possibly belonged to the Maidi tribe and once was a soldier with the Romans but became a prisoner perhaps due to rebellion against or desertion from the army and then he was sold as a gladiator. Other differing sources say Spartacus was a captive taken by the legions and trained at the gladiator school near Capua in 73 BC. Spartacus was a heavyweight gladiator called a mermillo. These fighters carried a large oblong shield and used a sword with a broad straight blade called a gladius about 18 inches long. In 73 BC, Spartacus was among a group of gladiators plotting an escape from the gladiator school. About 70 slaves were part of the plot. Though few in number, they grabbed kitchen utensils, fought their way free from the school and seized several wagons of gladiatorial weapons and armour. This interpretation is from the film Spartacus from 1960 of them fleeing the gladiator school. The escaped slaves defeated soldiers sent after them, plundered the region surrounding Capua and recruited many other slaves into their ranks. They eventually retired into a more defensible position in Mount Vesuvius. Once free, the escaped gladiators, numbering 90,000 to 100,000, chose Spartacus and two other slaves, Crixus and Enomaus, as their leaders. Together, they used guerrilla tactics to fight off Roman attackers. After about a year, the group mobilised and started travelling throughout the Roman Empire. They marched as far north as Gaul, which is modern-day France. Rome initially considered the revolt a nuisance. With each of Spartacus' victories, however, Roman leaders started to take the group more seriously. In 71 BC, General Marcus Lysanius Crassus defeated the rebel army at Lucania around 35 miles southwest of Naples. Spartacus was believed to have died in this battle. Around 6,000 men survived the battle but were later captured and crucified by the Roman army. Spartacus has long served as an inspiration to those seeking to revolt against oppressive rule. He is considered brave and an able leader who fought against tremendous odds with remarkable success. Don't forget, if you enjoyed this video, to like it and subscribe to the channel or follow me at Twitter at littlemisshistory81 at tanyarelix38 or at Facebook at facebook.com forward slash tanyarelix38.